Normally, I'm out here in the mornings doing the morning meditation, but I wanted to come here as the sun is setting and share something with you. Yes, I voted today, but most importantly, I brought my grandfather's mason ring with me. I've had it with me all week. I knew I would be voting this week. My grandfather was born in 1905. And the things this man witnessed in this country. And today to whisper into that unseen realm, granddaddy, we have voted for not only a black man, but now a black woman. A man who saw and witnessed the strange fruit swinging from the trees. When I say I am honored and I remember them Oh, they were heavy on me. You will vote. You will vote. And I was young and thought, ah, my vote doesn't count. Now I know. My grandmother was born 1912, my granddaddy 1905. And they saw the fight. And those who were unalived simply because they wanted to exercise their right to vote. Today, I exercise the right for my ancestors, and I lift up all of their names, and I say, Ashe, 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 O. Oh. I was honored to go cast my vote this day and honor my ancestors. I don't care how you vote. You owe it to your ancestors. Respect the sacrifice that they all, including my granddaddy, that they all made for each of us to be able to live in a type of peace. It may not be fullness of peace, but to live in peace and to have the right to vote. Respect the sacrifices of your ancestors from the middle passage all the way till today. Respect the sacrifices. Go vote.